grams of each. Actually, no, I'll go, I'll go um, to make sure it's actually 200 mils, which is what I used to put in scratchos. We'll go for um, 120. So this is some GP330 PU going into the, what do we call this plane? Scramble. The scramble, of course we did. The scramble wing. So I will give the 330 a shot. It's currently the ambient temperature is about 18 to 19 degrees C. And um, the foam's about the same because um, Andrew's just checked it with the thermometer. Do you need a timer for this or you just... I've got it ready. Um, your screen's black. Oh yeah. I might just go and do that. Okay, you can start it now. Oops, sorry, I kept it there. Just add another five. Tell me when. Okay, go. Start it. <coughs> Dignity there, but anyway. Yeah, you got need more down that end, that's for sure. Okay. Just quickly trying to get it up to the cutting oh, okay. edge yeah. and so on. the trailing edge. Uh-huh. <coughs> yeah, these quick planes. What's the plan? Well, we'll just watch that it rises, which I think it already is looking like doing. It, it already looks like a hell of a lot more volume than what we used before, didn't it? You used before? What do you mean? <laughs> now, it's already at the point, Dave, where if I touch it, it sinks back. And we're only up to 1 minute 41. Yes. So it's not, it's certainly not evenly spread, but it's reasonable. So I just thought, let it, let it grow up a little bit. Well, to be honest, we can join the moulds now because um, there's no advantage. We haven't, when I have one on the other side, we normally let it grow up a bit. Oh shit, look at that. Just yeah, from, right. I, I didn't get the last bit out. Look at that. <laughs> blowing up. So that'll give us an idea how much working time we've got, I guess. Like a porn star's YouTube channel, it's blowing right. up. Gloves off. Whoa, here we go. <laughs> Okay, and we need our alignment pins in a sec too. Yep. Well, here I've got two, one, two, hang on, there's the other one. How much more that's that's expanded now since we just looked at it a minute ago. Yeah. Jeez. And that's, that's 18 degrees. Uh, it's actually no, it's 19, 19 and a half. I do beg your pardon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not too bad. 
Good. That's amazing, isn't it? For the yeah. little bit that was left on the bottom there. Yeah. Well, you'd think that'd be kind of about the maximum expansion now. So now what? We wait for how long? Two hours? Well, no, we've got to pull our, pull our spaces oh, yeah, out yeah, yeah. and um, close it up. I'm just not yeah. sure when. It'd be nice to see stuff coming out the edges, but I don't think we're going to. I kid myself I can hear it pushing. <laughs> um, I reckon we should uh, take the chocks out and... Um, Pull the chocks out. Alright. Chocks away. <clears throat> so we're taking the chocks out at what time? Uh, five and a half minutes, Dave. Five and a half Better minutes. Remember stuff. Okay, we're all happy to clean it up. Mm -hmm. You can actually plant across these things too, they'd be perfectly strong for that. It's not too late. And even on yeah, even under these would be pretty fine. Should spray them with a bit, bit of oil. Has not been oiling his clamps. Is that a euphemism? No. <laughs> <laughs> not everything is a dirty joke, Dave. Oh, why not? Come on. <laughs> well, I mean, as we could see by that polyurethane, at that temperature, it's the ambient temperature of the mould and the liquid, there's a lot more action. There's a lot more action happening, eh? Mm. That's phenomenal. So is I this mean, where we confess we tried two lots of a different foam and it didn't work? <laughs> See, when you look at that, I reckon, how much was left after I tipped it in? Probably, oh. you know, five mil? Yeah, not a lot. And, what's, and this is a...